listen, we're kissing, we touching. She stops me and said, wait, wait, wait. How much you gonna pay me? I swear. Oh, you mean pay attention? Oh, okay, okay, never mind. I thought, I thought, you know, he was talking about money for a second. I could have swear he was talking about money. He said, wait, wait, wait. What are you talking about? She's now she's like, talking pay attention. Pay how much you gonna pay for it? This is Oh, oh she want pussy. money, money. I'm like, how much are you gonna pay for this? This is expensive pussy. You just think I'm gonna share my body with you for no reason? Backing up. Backing up. Say it's yo boy, it's your boy Silver Man back with another video. How y'all doing today? Your boy is feeling great, man. As you can see, we got somebody new to the channel today. I got Brandon Rashad, a story time reaction for you guys. If you guys don't know who this is, he is another reactor just like me. And today, he's actually telling a story time. And the reason why I chose to react to this video is because two reasons one it popped up on my recommended and you guys know if it's in my recommended that's a sign from the most i say hey you know what i'm saying hop on that and two i also saw another story time from him where she was trying to give him a baby or something like that but this one i'm actually curious about she told me to pay for it hey we about to just hop right into it but wait if this is your first time seeing the kid on the screen make sure you murder that like button if you enjoy the video if you don't enjoy the video you can leave a dislike too comment down below what you want to see me react to next if you guys want to see a story time from me i have a lot of them just comment down down below that you want to see a story time and don't forget to join the family and subscribe to the channel thank you guys for 300 subscribers road to 1000 man this year we're hitting a thousand subscribers mark my words and without further ado that's enough talking we're about to hop right into it easy story about this time I kicked it with this Instagram influencer. This happened like three or four months ago, bro. I, 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 I'm i just tell y'all, I wasn't gonna tell anybody, but I mean, I ain't about to put old girl name on a screen or nothing. But okay. look, I kicked it with this Instagram influencer. We had a good time, but y'all not gonna believe what these girls are out here doing. Let's talk about it. Yo, let's go. She wanna swim, hold your breath. I can see Brandon as like a rock star. Like he he gives me that rock star vibe. Gang in a stack, gang, gang. Bro, listen, man. Listen. Maybe like three or four months ago, I kicked it with this beautiful, thick chocolate. Okay, she wasn't chocolate. She was maybe like my skin tone or a little bit darker. But anyway, I kicked okay. it with this one Instagram influencer, bro. Right? I slid in her DMs. Me and her, we were talking here and there. Ha, ha, ha. Cracked a few little jokes, you feel me? And she was like, yeah, you could pull up. We could kick it. Mm -hmm. We could have a good time. I asked her, you smoke, you drink? She was like, don't worry about it. I got the weed and I got some drink. Just pull up. I was like, cool. Listen. Hey, you guys should know. Offer it. If a female says she got the weed or the drink, that automatically means she wants to have a good time. And that honestly means that, hey, I'm trying to have some fun, you know what I'm saying? I don't drink, but I mean, I just know that though. I pulled up to baby girl house. I had to make sure my car was looking good. Y'all know I got it. I got Max? a Camaro. It's a nice little black drop top Camaro. So anyway, you know, I got the car washed. Car was looking good. I was looking good, feeling good. I threw on hella chains. I Max? had ice on it, nigga. I even had the little icy bracelet on. I was feeling good, you feel me? I feel you, anyway, I feel you. I pulled okay. up to baby girl house. Call her like, yeah, I'm downstairs. She's like, all right, I'm coming. I'll let you up. She came downstairs. Off top, listen, I need to explain this to you guys. Off top, when you hang out with a girl, you have to break something called the touch barrier. So, off top, when she came outside, I gave her a hug. I said, oh, what's up? It's nice Facts. to meet you. Boom. No, no, no handshakes. You feel me? Yo, <laughs> nice to meet you. Facts. Nah, cuz. Nah. Bring it in. Off bring top, it in, I let her know, in. listen, this is about to be touchy-filly. Yeah, we got a yeah. hug. Mm, said, nice to meet you. We walk in, we talk in, we in the elevator, regular ass chit chat. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna tell you something, while we in the elevator, I'm looking at her. I'm giving her the sexy eyes, you feel me? I'm looking at her up and down, <laughs> she's being kinda shy. Hey. She's talking to me, she's looking oh, at me. Hold on, oh, what just happened? One thing I can say though, my boy Brandon knows what he's talking about. He knows, he, he got a little sauce to him, you know what I'm saying? Hey, let's go, let's go. I mean, we, we lock eyes here and there, she kinda like smiling and shit. She even tells me, like, I like how you look. Your tattoos, your whole vibe. Yes, sir. She says this to me while in the <laughs> elevator, bro. I've only met her for like two minutes. She's okay. like, I like how you look. Your tattoos, your vibe. You just, mm, I like that. I, I like, like that. Oh, I'm about to smack. Easy. Easy. So, 
Yes, sir. So, we go upstairs. We get in her apartment. She got a nice little apartment. So, we in her apartment. She like, yeah, I just got some weed. We could smoke. I got some Henny in the fridge. We could drink. I was mm-hmm. like, yeah, grab the Henny. So, we grabbed the Henny. I'm drinking some Henny. She's drinking wine, and we're smoking together and just talking. Talking about anything. Whatever. You know, we're talking. Yeah. we laughing. I'm really good at having conversations. Listen, when you have conversations with women, just let them talk. <laughs> I'm going to keep it a stack. It's very easy. Yeah, just let you them say talk. little things here and there. You maintain your masculine frame. Don't be all like, yeah, girl. Woo, woo. <laughs> no. You want to make sure that she sees you as like, mm, I'm trying to fuck the shit out of him. Exactly. Keep so the anyway, vibe. We sit there, we talking, we laughing, contact. this and that, this and that. After we drinking, we smoking, we kind of lit. You feel me? I'm tipsy and I'm faded. She tipsy and she faded. I'm making sure, like I said, when I first hugged her, threw off the whole night of us kicking it. I'm touching her here and there. Like when mm-hmm. she first was about to pour me my Henny, she went to her freezer to grab the Henny, right? The Hennessy. So I made sure, like, I went over there next to her. I put my arm around the small of her back, and I pulled her to me, and I was saying something. I forgot what I said. Yeah, but she you just want to keep her my close hand to you. went down to her booty. I'm rubbing her booty right when we talking. Sir. She didn't even care. Nigga, I knew I was about to smash. Anyway, fast Facts. forward. You kicking it. We having a great time, right? Mm-hmm. We on her couch. We sitting all close. I got my arm around her. We start kissing. We kissing. We touching. All of all, that, yeah, right? All of that, mm-hmm. This is when shit gets crazy. Why did she stop me? Listen, we kissing, we touching. She stops me and said, wait, wait, wait. How much you gonna pay me? I swear. Oh, you need to pay attention. Oh, okay, okay, never mind. I thought, I thought, you know, he was talking about money for a second. I could have swear you something. They said, wait, wait, wait. How much you gonna pay me? I swear. To God, we lit, we faded. Well, I'm lit at this time because I was drinking Henny straight up. So I was drunk, nigga, I'm drunk, and mm-hmm. I was hot. Okay. So she stops me like, wait, 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 how much you going to pay for it? I'm like, what are you talking about? She's she like, stopped to pay attention. Pay how much you going to pay for it? This is Oh, oh she want awesome. money, money. I'm like, ha, 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 I laugh it off because I'm lit. So I'm like, what the fuck is this bitch talking about? She ain't no prostitute. What are you talking about? <laughs> I try to go back to it and start kissing her. She's like, no, wait, wait, wait. I'm serious. Wait. Oh, oh all right, all right, all right, all right. So right. I'm like, oh, you know, you got to cool out. Yeah, too. cool out, cool out. She's like, how much are you going to pay for this? This is expensive pussy. You just think I'm going to share my body with you for no reason? Back it up! Back it up! Back it up! Back it up! So I'm like, okay, wait, hold on. What do you mean share your body for no reason? You invited him. We're chilling. We're drinking, smoking. You know, the vibe is there. What do you mean share for no reason? Like, what? I don't know. What? She's like, I charge men in order to have sex with me. You want to have sex with me. You want to explore this body. How much are you going to give me? And I was just like... I'm not paying anything. What are you talking about? Facts. She was like, I charge every man I have sex with. Listen to this. I'm not even going to put this rapper on blast. Never mind. She told me <laughs> the rapper, she said literally the month before, 10 bands. And he paid 10 bands. She's like, listen, I know you're not a rapper, so you're not going to pay 10 bands. But I want at least three. What? Wait, 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 wait. So she charged a rapper 10 bands for some cootie? Like, first of all, me having sex with you isn't just for me. It's for the both of us. So, yes, you're giving me kushi, and I'm giving you digging sticks. So, let's put that to the side. You know what I'm saying? Like, why Why is it... I don't even understand. Like, like a lot of people have this mentality. Like, a lot of girls have this mentality. And I'm just like, bro, what do you mean pay for it? I was like... You want me to give you $3,000 so me and you can have sex? She's like, yes. You're going to be able to enjoy my body. I want to get something out of it. I want three bands. I want $3,000. You get it digging stuff? Like, you can cash at me right now. PayPal, it doesn't matter. She started Cash out? I'm kind of laughing. I'm thinking she's playing still at this time. Because this is prostitution, bro. Facts. So I'm laughing too. I guess because I was lit, so I was being extremely just straightforward. Mm. I let her know. I'm like... You're a prostitute? Like, this is prostitution. <laughs> like, no, I'm not no prostitute. What are you talking about? I ain't no prostitute. I'm but you're saying, if you want to explore my body, you have to give me something in return. Is that not prostitution? 
Is that not prostitution? You're paying to have sex with someone. What is she talking about? Am I tripping? Like, I'm confused. You could buy me something expensive or you got to give me three racks. She's like, look around in my apartment. Look around my apartment. She was like, how do you think I'm able to take care of myself? Take care of my daughter? She like, I charge people. So and I'm besides, I'm not paying three racks to to go in some loose coochie. I'm not I'm not doing it. What are you three racks? That's like two months rent. I'm not no. I'm sorry. She tripping. Hi key. What do you want? How much you gonna give me? I want three bands. I'm like, yo. My mind was blown because she was so beautiful. She was beautiful. She was <laughs> Mark. She's an Instagram influencer. I was like, three bands, nigga? That's crazy. Automatically turned off. Facts? I turned off. I did not want Sober her. Sober up one time. All. But wait, it gets deeper. I'm still a little bit confused. She's talking about how you think I afford all this. You see my nice apartment. It's a two-barrel apartment. I got daughter. I got mouth to feed. I got to take care of myself. Woo, woo, woo. So I'm like, okay, every time you have sex, you charge men? She's like, yes. Every single man I have sex with, they pay me. They cash me out for this. She's all like, where have you been? This is what all the girls do. I'm like, what? All the she girls? She told me, all the Instagram influencers, all the girls that's popping, charge these rappers money to have sex with them. She said rappers aren't out here getting bitches like that. They have to pay. So I'm just like. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hold on. I mean, she can be talking bullshit, but if she's not talking BS, think about all the bitches you see in music videos. How, you know, rappers say that, you know, they smash this female, smash that. What if she's actually being legit right now, saying that they have to pay? You're paying 10 racks for some coochie? Just because you have it, don't mean you spend it. And I'm not spending, I'm not spending nothing on no coochie. Like, what? I am not, no, I'm sorry. That's a, that's crazy, bro. What do you mean? Yo, this is this is cuckoo bananas. Facts. She's telling me how all the Instagram influencers, all the rappers, everybody is out here paying for women, and this is how women are getting paid nowadays. They're charging men for sex. They charging them for the nudes. They charging them. You already know for the OnlyFans. They doing. I was just like everybody. She's like everybody. It's crazy. Any girl that you talk to that's an Instagram influencer, you're going to have to cash her out. Bro, I couldn't believe it. Suffice to say, after that, she picked up on my vibe. She picked up on the fact that I was kind of judging her. I'm not going to lie. Facts! I mean, what do I you was mean? Just, like, so fucking, my mind was blown. You feel me? So anyway, she picked up on my vibe. She knew I wasn't about to pay because I've never paid no woman for sex. Facts. I ain't paying you for no sex. What are you talking Facts. about? So she was just like, listen, you ain't going to pay. You got to go. You got to go. All right. You ain't paying for nothing. You got to go. She was like, I thought you was going to be with it. I saw that you have over 600,000 followers. I know you got money. You could easily give me three bands. Why are you playing woo woo? I was just like, I ain't doing it. Mm, nigga, she kicked me out of her house. <laughs> but listen, bro, I needed to say this to you guys so y'all can realize these Instagram influencers, they not everything that they cracked up to be, man. Yes, they look good. Yes, they take mm -hmm. care of their bodies. Yes, they're doing what they're supposed to do to get the bag. But they care about the bag so much that they're literally selling their bodies for the bag. I'm not paying three bands for some loose coochie. You know what I'm saying? That shit probably why the SpongeBob mouth. I'm not I'm not doing it. When you are at a certain level in your career, you run into certain type of people and these type of people they want you to pay x amount of money to sleep with them it's no longer about pleasure for them it's literally just trying to get the bag which i i respect you trying to get the bag but certain things you do trying to get that bag is where i'm a little skeptical about but that was the end of the video man shout out to brandon rashad dope individual makes great content you guys check him out comment down below what you want to see me react to next and if you guys want to see my own story times i got story times just let me know make sure you murder that like button if you enjoyed the video and don't forget to join the family join the kid man subscribe to the channel and i'll see you guys in the next one yes sir ski